Hey guys, this is Anime Fan 401. I just watched uh, I just finished watching Cyberpunk Edge Runners today. I watched all 10 episodes. This is my review on it. So So um it's a pretty good anime. It's created by the same people who made Kill the Kill. And um the animations was pretty good. And, um, I know it was a video game way before it became an anime, uh, but it doesn't have Keanu Reeves, so I can tell you that. I just thought I'd check it out on net. It's, a, it's available, it's got 10 episodes available on Netflix, so I watched it on. And, um, well, there's a lot of, um, a lot of action scenes in there. And also, and the um, kill count and the, the death count, the kill, the body count that they that rack that they rack that a show rack that you see on the show that that racks up is ridiculous, and that and there's a lot of um, vehicles getting totaled on the show. Crap ton of vehicles get totaled on the show. And I believe one of the actors on, and I found out one, and one of the characters on there, one of the fixers, is played by Gu, by the actor who played Gus Fring on Breaking Bad. Look there, look it, look him up, look up the cast and crew for it up in the eye, in the um, look up the cast and crew for the English dub. Trust me, the one who played Gus Fring is on it. When I first heard his voice, I said, that sounds like, when I first heard, saw that particular fixer come up in the couple, one of the certain episodes, yeah, when I heard his voice, I go, that sounds like Gus Fring from Breaking Bad. Straight up. And, um, the animations, like I said before, was good to great. And, um, well, I also have to say, um, the action was pretty good. And, um, yeah. I give this one a 10 out of 10. So, if you have Netflix, go watch it there. It's a most rec I recommend this anime. It's pretty good. If you played the video game, yeah. I recommend you watch this anime if you haven't watched it yet. I haven't played the game, but I've heard about it, and yeah. And I thought the anime was pretty good. It was made by Studio Trigger, the same people who made Kill the Kill, I believe. I'll just get one of the DVDs of Kill the Kill, and I'll be right back. Yep. I've just checked it. Same animation like this. So yeah, it was Studio Trigger. Just had to double check that. So, I hope you enjoyed my review on Cyberpunk Edge Runners. If you did, hit the like button, subscribe, and share. And don't forget to click on the notification bell. And I'll see you on the next one. Johnny.